Welcome ladies and gentlemen to another indie horror game. Today we're playing Night Donna, where we've just started the night shift in a Donna shop. At first, everything seems ordinary and quiet, but we'll soon realise that this is no ordinary night. Quite like the kiosk indie horror game I played on this channel a while back, uh, we'll be prepping meals for people late at night. So without further ado, let's get skewering. This job offer came quite suddenly, working as a night Donna shop worker. It sounds strange, but I was looking for a job, and that's when it came up. The owner said that the previous employee had suddenly quit and disappeared. They needed someone in a hurry, so I took the job. I thought working here must be easy. After all, how hard can it be? Take orders, prepare the donors, close the day. But still, the sudden disappearance of the previous employee made me think. I don't know what's going on here, but it looks like it's going to be a long night. These type of shops, they always they always need someone last minute. Uh, right, we've got our, looks like our coffee stand here. Um, oh, we've already got a customer. Okay, hello. Hello, good luck. Are, are you my boss? Why, why are you saying good luck? I'll have a donna and a Coke. All right, so we've got a little order here. A normal donna. Right, that's our prepping station. Let's look at the recipe book. Yes, much like the kiosk. We've got our pita bread, we've got our meats, tomatoes and vegetables. Uh, if customers want something different, they say so themselves and it appears on the cash register screen. Okay, so what did you want? A normal donna. Well, okay, does that mean... Well, let's get the bread. Lavash. We'll have a lavash. We'll put it down here. Does that mean a normal donna with ketchup and mayonnaise or without? I guess we'll, we'll have it. We'll see. We'll get... Oh, hello. Got to be very careful with the meat here. Um, right, we've got a tomato. Put that on there. Oh, nice. Sliced it already for me. Got some lettuce. We'll do the same. Very nice. So we'll take the lettuce slice. We'll pop it there. Get the tomato. Pop it there. Um, there we go. We're prepping your meal, sir. We're doing it for you. Special. And it's just appeared out of nowhere. There you go. No. All right. All right. Um, right. Let's get the cola for you. Not that you're going to be mad. A normal Donna. That was not a normal Donna then. <laughs> oh, is that the tomato didn't... Hang on. Hang on. Is it not a normal Donna because the tomato slice didn't get... Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. All right, we'll try that again, shall we? We'll try that again. Here's the meat. There's the tomato. There's the lettuce slice. And we'll complete the recipe. And hopefully it will include the tomato. Because I know you demand your tomato, sir. And I'm here to serve you. All right, and it's left the lettuce slice. <laughs> You're not going to accept that, are you? No, of course not. Because it left the lettuce... What, what do we have to do here? How can I... <laughs> first day on the job. It's my first day, all right? It's my first day. Right, let's try that again, shall we? Get over here. Put the meat down. Put the lettuce. Put the tomato. No, not underneath it. On top. Complete. The tomato hasn't gone in, has it? <sighs> it's going to be a long shift. It's going to be a long night. Yeah, I know. I know. Uh -oh. I yeah, I don't know what to tell you, my friend. I'm putting it there. I'm putting it... <laughs> right. Let's try putting a tomato slice on. Let's move you over here. Put you on top there. Get the meat. Come on. I'm sorry, you're going to have the lettuce from the floor, okay? Not a five second rule, but... That looks like it took all the ingredients. That looked like it did. Okay. If there's something left... There we go. There we go. Jesus. Thanks. Keep the change. That's very kind of you, sir. It only took me three attempts, but we got there. Right. Wow. Okay. Um... Oh, I hear, I hear floorboards creaking. We haven't actually checked. So this is where our... So, hello. Oh, you're back. Was the Donna that good? 
Good evening. I could use a coffee. It's going to be a long night. Yeah, I, I get the feeling it's going to be a long night as well, my friend. Right. Is the coffee... Is there a coffee machine anywhere? Is this the coffee machine? This doesn't look like a coffee machine. That looks like more, more of a soda stream. But uh, you know what? Who cares? That's your coffee. Yeah, it's coffee, all right. There you go. I hope your coffee will warm me up a bit. Okay. You flirting with me. Oh, broken glass on the... Um... Can we go outside? We cannot go outside. Uh, what do we have back here? So we've got all the things here. Got a bin for rubbish, I'm guessing. Yeah. All right. Getting the hang of it now. Getting the hang of it. Hello. Good night. Can I have three beers? I had an argument with someone outside. He made me very angry. Anyway, maybe I just need a beer. All right. Uh, you want three beers. So I'm going to tell you this. I used to work at a kiosk shop. The guy wanted some beers as well, but he drove home that night and the next day he died. So, you know, all I'm saying is don't drink and drive. I don't want your death on my conscience, okay? And for another thing, I'm going to tell you this because I'm supplying you a beer now. You know this hunk of meat here? When it came into the shop, it was labeled in a bag with the biohazard sign on it and it had on it incinerate only. That's all I'm going to say about the meat in this place. I mean, just look at it. Where it would seem to be some kind of shop just outside Hicksville nowhere. Thank you. I mean, we got the, the burger, burger, burger piz, burger piz on the left-hand side there. And cars are just randomly going through. I don't know where the hell I am here. Let's close the door. All right, we're, we're definitely going to have to sort out this, this kind of situation here where the items, the ingredients aren't actually going into the Doner Kebab. Oh, hello. Good night. It's a bit of a walk in this neighborhood at night. Peaceful, isn't it? Everyone is asleep, but people like you are awake. That I mean, because I'm I'm serving you the goddamn meal here, woman. Well, I'm, of course I'm going to be awake. You're walking around, supply and demand. Maybe this is when the true face of the world comes out. Are we waxing philosophical here, or do you just want a doner kebab? All right. Anyway, I can have a doner kebab without lettuce and mayonnaise. Donna without lettuce, Donna with ketchup. Okay, well, let's try this. Let's try this without lettuce. So we've got a tomato here. We're gonna we're gonna smash this up on the knife. Nice. We're gonna get our meat first. Let's get the meat. Came in the incinerate bag only. Put that down. We'll put you down in the middle. Uh, you want your tomato? Put that on top. Um, with ketchup. Okay. Let's put the ketchup on. I don't know if that's going on. We don't know. We don't know. We just don't know. And uh, prepare. Looks like the ingredients have gone through. I'm hoping for you. And for me. There we go. No? You don't like that? Well, we need more pita bread. Where's the bread? Where's the goddamn bread? Where? Oh no! Get up! Oh, it's just gonna. It's just gonna have a few, few hairs on it from the um, carpet there, but that's fine. Right. Let's try that again. Or do we? Mm, let's just try this. Right. Okay. Okay. So. The little ketchup has... My god, really? Your predecessor made a better return. But for some reason, he suddenly stopped working here. Even though he worked so hard to get a job here. Anyway, good night. Right, so you have to put the ketchup and the mayonnaise on the donut afterwards. I have never heard that before. I don't know what that is, but all right. Hello, can I get two chips and two Cokes? That's great, because it doesn't mean I have to make a goddamn doner kebab. Um, we've got chips here. There we go. I'll throw that at you. And what was it? Uh, and cola. Cola, cola, cola. Soda? Cola. Hmm. 
Yep, I don't care now. There you go. Thanks. Chips and Coke while watching a movie at this time. It's going very well. Good luck. You watching that movie by yourself? You fat hippo, huh? You're going to have the chips and the coke all to yourself? I bet you are. Right, we need more pita bread, I guess. I should just make a coffee as well, but, um... Oh. Is that an alarm? We're ending the shift. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Oh, God. Day two, and you're already here. Hi, a full donor and a soda. I can take it. Well, I'm, I'm guessing you would be able to take it. Otherwise, you know, why would you want it? Unless you're allergic to something and you're just testing yourself. Right. Donna with ketchup and mate. Right. Okay. We've got, we've been restocked. It's the second shift. Right. Let's get the meat. Let's get the meat. Let's put it over here. Um, tomato. Don't worry about that. Five second rule. Let's cut that up. We've got the lettuce. Cut that up. I'm gonna make sure that all the ingredients uh and make sure all the ingredients are there. So what was it? Donna with ketchup and mayonnaise and a soda. So let's make that. While that's going on, I'll get your soda for you. Think you can handle that? I think you can. Uh with ketchup and mayonnaise. So I've this is yeah, because there you see the white there. I've never, I've never heard of putting the condiments on the wrapped donna. That's ludicrous. That is terrible. But hey, here you go. You couldn't have been any slower. Hey, hey, go fuck yourself. All right, lady. I'll take your money. But seriously, go fuck yourself. Yeah, walk off into the night. I hope that car crashes into you. All right. All right. I just realized as well, this could actually be a wordplay. Night donor instead of donna. You're in creaky, creaky wood paneling going on here. Is this my own little motorhome here? Like, this doesn't look like a shop to me. This looks like a house. Am I just, I've just knocked down the wall and I thought to myself, I'll have that entrepreneurial spirit and I'll sell donna kebabs. Hello, sir. Hello, I just want a beer. Give me one, two, three, four beers. You're in a playful mood, aren't you? Four beers. I mean, we didn't hear anything back from that guy that I gave three beers to yesterday that had an argument with someone. I wonder if he's going to be coming back in this shift. Maybe. As long as he hasn't died, you know, I can end my shift with a clear conscience. No red? Anyway, you can give red next time. Good luck. Re red? Red what? Red beer? What are you talking about? I don't know what that means. You wanted ketchup on your beer? Hmm, okay. So far, I'm not hearing much of a story. Oh, you're back again. Hi, I'll take a full donor. Yesterday, a few blocks away, I shot a man with a beer bottle. They killed him. You heard about that? What? <laughs> what are you talking about? You you shot a man with a beer bottle? What is, is this? Be is this script being written by AI or something? <laughs> what does that mean? Donna with ketchup and mayo. Okay, um, you know what? You're a paying customer. Oh, what was that? I just saw some eyes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, all right. Okay. Um, <laughs> well, Donna with ketchup and mayo. You want the, you want the works. Okay. All right. Let's, I don't know if that's gone in. Let's just let's put that down. That looks like it's down. That looked like it's down. We'll make that. And what did you want? A cola. I'll get the cola for you. All right. <clears throat> There's your cola. All right. And you want the uh, with ketchup and mayonnaise. I do like the sound effect of the ketchup and mayonnaise, though. It's like when you... Uh, oh. We have a squirt of there. Hey. Hey, now. like when you do your 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 that impression with your your cheek the I can do it as well I can make sound effects great here you go sir I'm very uncomfortable being out at night anyway thank you 
I think the dev might need to look at the um, the text. Uh, I think something went wrong, or maybe he fell asleep at the keyboard, and um, just pushed all the, the the letters down. Good evening. I could use a coffee. Could you now? Great. All right. One coffee coming up. That's it. You don't want anything else? Just coffee. Long night ahead. Okay. It's gonna be fresh. Oh, come on, lid. Come on, lid. Come on, lid. Get on there. There we go. There we go. Give me a bit of trouble there. Oh, and a cola. You didn't say that before. All right. My second day. Thanks. Keep the change. I will. Thank you. So we had a random guy just appearing at the window. The glass is gone now. So we've obviously cleared that up. Um, can't see anyone out here sneaking around. Um, hmm, yeah, okay, okay. Hello, sir. Good night. Can I have a coffee? Sure you can. Sure you can. Anything for you, buddy. As long as you give me a tip. There we go. One coffee. I heard a strange news on the radio this morning. Somewhere in the city, a strange sound was recorded. People don't know what it is, but everyone is scared. I shudder when I think about it. What what kind of strange sound? I had a guy that just turned around to me and said he killed someone with a bottle cap. I mean, is this the, the banshee well of a coked up orangutan? Is it the wailing screech of a of a gazelle? Like what kind of what, you're not gonna give me any more info? Just a strange sound. Okay. Anyway, good luck. I won't keep you. Thanks. I'll be on the lookout for some strange noises. I mean, it seems like already someone busted the glass on my first day. I like how you can peek out the little blinds here. Got our aircon on. We're good. Strange noises in the night, eh? Alright. Oh. Thanks, that's the end of that shift. Day three. Wow. Already out the gate. Hi, a full donor. With a with a I'll have three beers. With I'll have three beers. Let's get you let's um while that's going let's make this up. Make sure all the ingredients are here. Cut that up on the knifey knife. Thank you very much. Got the lettuce. Okay, some lettuce is on the ground, but we're not that fussed about health and hygiene. You know, my rating's like two. I've got a two two rating scale. These look like all good. No, don't know about that. There you go. We'll prep that. And what was it? You wanted colas. Beers. Three beers. No problem. No problem. There's one. There's two. And there's three. Uh, Donna with ketchup and mayo. Right. So we know how this is working now. The weirdest mechanism of putting mayonnaise and ketchup on a Donna kebab. I mean, it's wrapped up, right? Why would you be... Maybe maybe this is an American thing. I don't know. This is not how we do Donna's in the UK. That's all I'm saying. Today has been a really long day. Something seems to be getting harder. Oh well, I hope I can relax a bit with these beers. Maybe the area that I'm in that people just talk funny. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe it has nothing to do with the, um, the text or anything. Okay, we've got some lettuce slices here. Let's put these down on the floor again. Because why wouldn't you? Might need those again. And then the customers will never know. They will never know. I'll have a coffee, two chips, and a couple of beers. Okay. Right, well, let's get the coffee going. Let's close that. I'm just going to have to open it again in a second, but coffee. Chips. How many chips do you want? Two chips. Okay. That's two chips. Uh, two beers. Bit of an odd uh, order you've got going on here, I've got to say. Maybe you're having a coffee now and that you're just waiting for the beers and the chips later on. Who am I to judge? Thank you. All right. A 
Of ik maps. So we've only had one encounter with someone at the window. Um, nothing else strange seems to be happening. <laughs> okay. Or well, something happened. I think I missed it. Hello. Good luck. Why do they keep on saying good luck? I'll have a Donner and a Coke. Okay, what kind of Donner? Just a normal Donner and a Cola. Let's get your Cola first so you're not whining at me. I obviously missed... It's always when I just say it, something happens. Uh <laughs> right. A normal Donner. You didn't specify ketchup or mayonnaise, so we're not going to give you that, all right? Come on, meat. Come on, meat. Come on, meat. Get down there, meat. There we go. That's what I wanted. That looks like completed. That's all the ingredients in there. Fantastic. We're really getting the hang of being a Donner Kebab shop owner here. Or well, we're not an owner. We're just doing the shifts, aren't we? There you go. Thanks. Keep the change. Thank you. All right. Yeah, I'm not sure what that bright light was. Was that meant to be someone in a car or someone across from the Burger Piz place? Trying to scare me? Don't know. Nothing outside? No lore or text or anything? Okay. Oh, it's you again. You didn't give me a sparkling recommendation last time, did you? Can I have two sodas? Of course you can. Uh, sodas. Soda is the green. Uh, we'll pick one up from the floor. Just don't open it. It's going to be a bit fizzy. I just saw a man lingering at the entrance of the shop. It gave me a little chill. Anyway, good luck. I don't see anyone here. Don't see through peeking through the curtains. No. Can we actually... We can't open the door, can we? No. No. Hi. I'll have a donut and a coffee, but no lettuce. And ketchup and mayonnaise. That would be great. Fair enough. Let's make that coffee. Oh, you didn't want the lettuce. Okay, we'll drop the lettuce. Didn't say anything about not having tomato, though. With ketchup and mayonnaise. Okay, so we'll start that. We'll get your coffee sorted out. Well, look back. What am I looking back at? Is there someone to be behind me? Hoi! I mean, I can't arm myself with a knife, no? Look back here. Is there someone in the... No? This is all good. And the power's gone off. And now something's... There's glass again. Who keeps on smashing the door? Or the window? Oh, now, now you're playing silly buggers with me, huh? Playing silly people? Hmm? I got a knife. And I've got some questionable meat as well. So, click to hide. Oh, we don't like that. Oh. Okay. That's a freaky person. Um. No, I think we're gonna... Yeah, I think we're gonna hide. Better be quiet now. We can... Peak above. Nope. Not doing it. Be covering my 
they see me. Stealing all my money. Goddamn robber. Oh, shouldn't have peaked at that point. Oh, my alarm system triggered. I think he went away. I'm gonna stay in the bin for a bit. Just to be on the safe side. Okay. I think he's gone. Don't know if I should get out. Should I get out? Maybe. Maybe let's get out. Ben, I think he's gone now. Goddamn robbers. You better not have taken my money. I'm a hard-working man. I work hard for these. Oh, the police are outside. Did they catch him? Did you catch him? I can't walk down the stairs. I'm treading in broken glass. My heart is almost bursting. What just happened? It was like a nightmare. That man, he tried to break in. Wait, he didn't try. He succeeded. He broke the door down. I was hiding in a bucket. If he had found me, I don't even want to think about what could have happened. I learned a lot tonight. But most importantly, that in order to survive, you have to make the right decision at the right time. Maybe this night made me strong. Maybe I was just lucky. But it's over for me now. So there you go, guys. That was Night Donner. Um, yeah. <laughs> I think that needs a little bit more polish. There wasn't, there didn't seem to be, there was just like a random guy. Like, he appeared at the window on the first shift, but it was so quick that he didn't even see what it was. In the second shift, something happened. Uh, some bright light, but I was facing away from the window, so we're not too sure about that. Yeah, I think the customers could have had a bit more information to tell us. That there was like, uh, well, what was the strange noise? The guy who killed someone with a beer cap? What what was all that? It was a little bit convoluted, I think. Um, otherwise, yeah, it, it seemed to be a bit buggy with the making of the donut as well. Like the first two attempts, when I kind of compiled all the ingredients together, it left out either the lettuce or the tomato. Um, and I don't understand the pouring of the condiments after the donna's been made, after it's been wrapped. Why, why would you pour ketchup and mayonnaise over a wrapped donna kebab? That doesn't make sense to me. Um, but apart from that, it was a good effort. It was a good effort. I do enjoy these type of games where you're, you know, prepping a few meals, talking to the local customers at night. Um, I just didn't get that horror vibe i didn't get i didn't feel any of time uh tension or or for sense of foreboding yeah it was just <laughs> we just got through the shift uh anyway guys let me know what you thought in the comments below like or dislike the video and if you haven't already please sub um each sub gets a free doner kebab terms and conditions apply anyway i'll see you in the next one stay ghoulish bye